Hi everyone! Welcome back for more Let's Play Retro Game Challenge. Get the DVDs. So, we have beaten Haggleman. I'm not going to say the full name of the game because it's wordy. Anyway, we have moved on to Rally King. Before we completely move on, I do not believe we've actually taken a look at the magazine. Let's see... Exclusive Rally King Info. Ultimate Techniques, First Review, Tricks and Tips. So, drifting through corners on this new racing game, Rally King. And the developer from Super Programmer G-Man talks about the drifting. And yes, Drift Boost. If you keep the... Basically, timing the drift boost, and you will see, I will I will be able to demonstrate a little better in game, but yeah, we have drift boosting that we will have to do to completely beat this game. And tracks have hidden shortcuts. Imagine that. And this, avoid accidents to save time, it makes squealing sounds, I've never managed, I have a hard time figuring that out. But anyway, I can generally beat it without worrying too much about slipping, sliding all the way. I have to worry about exploding, though. Eh. So, yeah, there's that. And here's a hint for Robot Ninja Haggleman, now that it made me say the full name of the game. You have a code here that will pop all the uh, scrolls in place. I'm not sure how many times a game. I never really used it. Maybe I'll try it out later. And Tomato, the team that made Cosmic Gate, making a new game. We will see what happens. We will see what they give us. And Ivana Tinkle says that wants to be, get paid to play and be a mag game magazine editor. Which, surprisingly enough, I remember that exact uh, letter appearing in the pages of EGM over and over and over. And Haggleman still in first place. And here's our new editor-in-chief, Dave. Hi, Dave. Okay, anyway. So, nothing super important there. But let's take a look at the game, shall we? Our new game, Rally King. Let's look at the manual. Because the first challenge is really simple. Drift Boost. And Drift Boost is actually pretty easy to pull off. Although, surprisingly, it's not easy to pull off exactly when you want to. But anyway. Thank you for buying Rally King. Your goal is Hull and McCray is to finish the tour number one, now enter into the wild world of rivalry, excitement, and squealing tires. So here's your, uh... Here are your controls. The control pad moves you left and right. A accelerates, B breaks, A and B together is emergency break, and you can pause the game. Understanding the on-screen info, you have the timer, you have the score, and you have your status gauge on the bottom. Goal, cross finish line. Four races, two laps each. Forest, desert, city, snowy summit. To drift or not to drift. Yeah. If you receive damage during the race and your gauge reaches zero, you explode. It takes one point for running into a wall, half point for bumping rival cars, and you have to finish 8th place or higher, or you get game over, and you can continue a few times. For drift, after reaching, you know, enough speed, you release the gas for a second and turn left or right to start drifting. Think Mario Kart, just a little, just a tad bit. Not exactly the same, but it, you kind of get the idea with the timing and such. Blue cars are slower, the purple cars are faster, and these are the ones you have to pass to finish to finish the race. So you have slippery spots and you have bumps that will either make you spin out or slow you down. The ramps will let you jump over most hazards that they appear right in front of, and will actually boost your speed just a tad. 
you get point and heart cars that you run over and recover part of your, either give you some extra points or recover hearts. And you get extra continues for every 20,000 points. And your score will steadily increase as long as you're driving over 200 kilometers an hour. Drift boots, drift boosts, just kind of, you know. And, you know, you've got to learn how to brake. And there's a quick, a quick biography of uh, Paul and McRae there. So anyway, enough of that. Enough reading. Time to actually play. And see if we can manage to drift boost twice in one race. Got to do it in one course. It's not that hard. See, it's top-down. You can bump into things and spin out from doing it. But remember, our goal is not to win this race. Aww. There's one. Aww. Come on. I'm just trying to boost. And that clears the challenge. Set you up nice for learning how to drift boost. Not running into other cars helps. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, I do notice that. It works for more than just driving games, though. It seems like every game you have to do hard left and right, you end up moving your body like that'll help. Of course, it does help nowadays with Connect and Wii and Move. Yep, especially with the Wii. Yep. Just wait till the future, Arino. Eh, kind of loose controls, but they work. Well, I didn't think you did. SimpleSoft made it. Now, we have to finish Course 1 regardless of rank or score. So we can just take it easy. And it's not that long a course, so I will probably do it in one sh I'll probably just be able to uh, finish it in the video. Keep on kicking. Or driving, in this case. Strategy guides are popular. Yes. And they will only get more popular. Actually, no I'm not. I don't like strategy guides. Although I will agree with them that if you get a magazine that gives you every tips every now and then, good enough. Nintendo Power and EGM were good enough for me back in the 80s and 90s. Anyway, let's beat that first course. Yep. Oh, I didn't even say that it was November 21st, 85, by SimpleSoft. Hyper Speed Rally Racing Action. So let's go. And yes, I do know about a few secrets to this game, but I'm avoiding using them until we actually see them in the magazine. Okay, let's do this. Serious? Serious what? Aww. I just gotta survive the course. I don't need to score or, uh... Wow, I won't survive the course at this rate. Oh, shut up. Oh, 
But I did get to blow up a car. Sometimes it seems like I might actually have some skill in RC Pro-Am or Rally King or various games of that type. I don't play many racing games. Rank 4, I will take it because it clears the challenge. I guess they haven't actually done it yet, but okay. Waste? Come on, man. Champagne isn't food. It's beverage. A beer shower would be cool. What do you know about beer showers, man? You're not even... I don't even know if you've gotten through puberty yet. Yeah, same as a Gatorade shower for a coach on the sidelines, man. No! I don't have homework anymore. Yeah, mine too. Exactly! Don't do that again, man. So what do we gotta do this time? Have to get fifth place or better in course two. Which will take a couple of minutes. Yeah, you've actually got a boost and such to get through there. Yep. Driving. Kicking a soccer man. Or football, for those of you on the other side of the Atlantic. And Pacific. And he bought a new magazine! Two new games announced for the magazine. Pro gamer who's really good. Doesn't understand what makes him so great. Do you know why this guy is so great? Well, out of the two choices, I'll pick rapid fire over his hairdo. That or he has a special controller, dude. Get a turbo controller. Like me. Okay. With the first couple of challenges in Rally King beaten, I think it's time to call it a video. When we come back, more Rally King. So until then, get the DVDs. See you later, people. Take care.